Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use ImageJ to measure length or ImageJ to measure multiple lengths with those measure length being short so that it won't confuse you of which one you have or which one you doesn't have already done. So the uh, ImageJ, about ImageJ, I'm using a version, the older version actually, ImageJ 1.44G. I download it, it's a free software you may download from their main page so uh, first of all you get it download into the system go to file open and then open the image that you want to open and then just like my any others video in order to uh, start measuring first of all you need to define its length a known length so you go to a line make sure your image comes with a lula or at least a scale in your uh, in your image so I okay straight okay then release then I go to analyze for image analyze set scale and then uh, non distance 29.92 centimeter okay sometimes it's zero so um, here is 29.92 sometimes you need to key in this value and you need to uh, unit of length is centimeter so it's correct so sometimes that comes up right because uh, I have just uh, uh, keyed in earlier. Huh? So if you doesn't have it, you need to change this length, unit of length to centimeter. You need to change distance, to non distance thirty. Okay. So press on OK. Then you're quite fit to go, right? To start off with, then what you could do previously is that uh, measure Control M. Now it's different. Yeah, you call R O I Manager. So when you record it, shortcut key, we press on the T button, or else you go to Analyze, go to uh, Tool, press on RI Manager, okay? Okay, so a new window pops up, okay? And I'm going to bring it over to the left so you can see, okay? The new uh, window. So what you do now, you will start measuring, okay? First line, okay? You press on T, yeah, it comes out right here or you add it okay then uh, draw a few lines then sometimes some user says oh is it possible uh, to make those lines permanent so that you know which which object you have measured okay you haven't measured it yet though I'm just uh, drawing those lines okay you will measure it towards the end of it okay add okay or you may press on the shortcut uh, key from a t keyboard press on the T yeah T yeah it comes out okay those are the uh, coordinates actually so sometimes uh, after a few few uh, length you measure they have no idea which one I have already measured so you may look at it so doesn't know which one is which one right so what you do is uh, you navigate your mouse to show all you check this box okay no need edit mode you're not going to edit it unless you want to edit it yeah then you may just edit accordingly but I just want to show all okay show all you should scale edit mode you know which one is to which okay so with that then, okay, draw another line, press on T, then it comes out again. Once you're satisfied with your measurement, what you do, you press on measure. When you press on measure, your result comes out. Okay, so this is the length. You may uh, copy this and paste into your Excel, and then uh, plot histogram with the normal distribution. Of course, uh, you, may, uh, you may want to uh, analyze this, this image, uh, analyze the uh, analyze and get histogram okay so the count mean standard deviation okay forget but you can't really export it right so oh you may copy it yeah actually you may able to copy it or you may want to uh, plot your own histogram with a uh, normal distribution graph from Excel you may refer to my uh, others video but with uh, with this, I think this video will show you on how to really um, labor all your length. You may add those length, you know? Once you're done, okay, oh, okay, you're not satisfied, maybe you miss out this one, you may still add it in, draw the line, press on T, but be sure you press on the measure, okay? So I'm going to show you, okay, you press on measure, see, the line will come out. Another equivalent length, equivalent length. 
1.155 so you doesn't want to add in but I mean you doesn't want to add two times yeah you just measure once you do so the rules will be you need to uh, finish drawing all you have satisfied with it then only you press on measure otherwise you have overlap yeah it will add lapping so this one overlap 2.7 is 2.7 here twice it comes up so it's not good if you uh, add on new lines you need to uh, delete all the uh, data and then uh, add them again okay that's all from me I hope you press on the thumbs up button to it means that you like my video it costs you nothing so that's all from me I hope it helps you in your research all the best thank you